On June the 1st, 1943, an incident took place over the Bay of Biscay off the coast of Spain, which caused an international outcry and has since remained a source of speculation and controversy. It involves the attack and shooting down of a Dakota DC-3 on its regular civilian route between Portugal and England, and it claimed the lives of several notable personalities in the British war effort and also Britain's premier movie star at the time. Mystery has always surrounded the motivation for the attack as to whether it was planned or purely accidental. It's a mystery that has a special significance to me as I was initially a passenger on flight 777. My parents had evacuated me from England and I lived with my mother's sister in New York. And then for reasons totally unbeknown to me, they brought me back in 1943, just in time for the flying bombs. This is where I would have been sitting on flight 777. But uh, this plane has been modified. <clears throat> the plane I was on had just single rows of seats, 14 seats in all. This one has double seats and there's 32 seats. So now my nanny and I, Dora Rowe, had traveled by ship from New York to Portugal on the Serpa Pinto, and it was now time to complete our journey back to England. I was actually sitting on my seat in the plane when at the last minute one of the airport staff came and we were removed from the plane. What happened then is that VIP Leslie Howard and his business manager Alfred Chennels took our places as they urgently required to get back to London. So we were taken off the plane and soon after we watched from the terminal as our plane accelerated along the runway and flew up into the clouds. The first three hours of the flight were uneventful, but then at 12.35, a squadron of Junkers U-88s was seen approaching. There, 